Hey, what's good guys? It's your boy Artie Creator and today I'm gonna show you how to make your own Instagram or Facebook filter with lots or color correction filter. Let's go! This lesson is the part of my course, Spark VR Studio for Beginners. In this course, we are gonna create most popular filters in Instagram and in the world. You can check it out in my course, link in the description to find more project-based lessons and a lot more lessons I have in this course. Super easy, useful information. See you in the class. And now let's go back to the video. This lesson we are gonna make LOD preset aka color filter. First thing you need is the load files I attached to this lesson. This is the folder called LUTs. You need to open LUTs PSD. This is file for Photoshop. Right here you can see how it working. So these are color LUTs test. And we have few images to test our LUTs or presets or color correction filters. So if you want to replace one of these pictures you just need to go ahead and open this folder, replace your picture, double click, open it and OK. So here you can add your own picture. And to make your own LUT, you should go to this folder. Here you can see different settings like saturation and a lot of different things, vibrance, brightness and contrast. You can play with it and create your own filter, for example, like that. I'm gonna add contrast. After you're done with settings, you just need to export this group. Just right click on this group and click export as PNG. But here's the second way to make your own LUT. So what you basically need is to make invisible these layers and make visible this layer. After you need to click on it, here you can see 3D LUT file. So what you basically need to do is to open it Lot 3D lot and upload any cube file. So at the end of this file should be should be cube. Cube files is already done presses with all settings done. It's like usual filter in Instagram or any program. So you just click on it and it's done. I'm gonna give you all these lot presses for free. So you can download it and use it for your filters. Okay, for example, I'm gonna use chill. Chill cube. Open. We have our chill right here. It would be better to make opacity a little bit, decrease opacity like that. And also if you want, you can play with these settings too, like situations and like that too. So what I'm doing is changing this cube filter with these settings. That's it. If you don't need any of these settings, you just need to make it invisible. I think it looks good. Let's go and export it. As with the previous one, we're gonna export this PNG. Let's go ahead and open Spark AR project. In folder you downloaded, you can see this folder. Let's open it and let's open Spark AR project. So this is the template for your lots. You just need to replace it with your lot replace and for example our test slot and wow we have our lot it's super good template because there's a lot of problems with retouching plus lot but in this template you can use retouch effect and lot together but if you don't want retouch effect you just need to go here skin smooth and make it on zero and here you can adjust level of skin smoothing like that you have your folder with PSD file to make your own LUT project from Spark ER and one folder of free LUTs. That's it guys, you create your own LUT filter. Thanks for watching. Once again, this is the part of my course, Spark ER Studio for Beginners. You can check it out, link in the description. See you in the class. It was your boy Ari Creator, peace.